What up, what up, what up? It's your boy Stunner Reese, and I'm back with another video, man. And today, guys, we got a lot of, lot of important things to do, man. Because first and foremost, man, in just two days, I am giving Scrappy away for only $20 raffle ticket, guys. So if you have it, man, stop what you're doing. Go in the description of my video right now and grab you a $20 raffle ticket to win my custom 1985 Monte Carlo SS man, aka Scrappy man. It is going to a new owner on July the 4th, and it could be you. All you got to do is take a chance. $20? Yeah, $20. So do what you need to do right now, man. Go in the description of my video and grab you a $20 raffle ticket for your chance to win. All right? Now, y'all already know, man, your boy Stunner Reese got a lot of stuff going on this weekend. So it includes me going to Cincinnati. And me and CJ on 32's first official car show together going down this Sunday, which we're going to get a car away at that event. So definitely, definitely, definitely make sure you attend both events if you can. And we definitely about to get lit, man. But we're about to get into this lit ass video because honestly, your boy Stun Reese, man, I got caught up in something real bad with Lady X. And I don't know how I'm going to get out of this. But y'all got to stick around for the whole video, man. All right, let's get to it right after this lit-ass intro. Yeah. I don't know nobody on my level. Dripping stars, like a rock and heavy metal. I just want a bag, like an old lady. I'm bad wood smoking, I don't own papers. Pass that 808, that don't, don't shake her. Oh, bitch, you know I'm grinding like a pro skater. Baby mama bugging, I'm so quick to hit it. living man y'all already know what it is y'all already know what it do man we gonna get to the what to the money man that's right man shout out to the whole 32 gang stunt squiddy x squad anybody who rock out with your boy stunner reese man i really truly appreciate y'all man y'all don't even understand man how much i love y'all man for all the support man all the people who congratulated me and my broski cj on 32s on the new whips man i hope y'all liking kavari that's right, man. That's the name of my new C8, Kavari. That's right, man. And the reason I came up with that name is because I feel that that car is like almost a mixture between an Italian-made supercar and an American-made supercar, especially the way mine is specced out. So definitely had to give it that, you know what I'm saying, crossbreed breed name, you know what I'm saying, to go with the crossbreed feel of the car. But definitely, man. But shout out to my people, man. The uh, auto enthusiasts, Euro auto enthusiasts, on the shirt man appreciate that man also y'all already know man i'm always rocking my su supporters merch people who rock with me man i'm always trying to show y'all love man if you're interested in sending me anything definitely shoot me an email which is in the description of this video and all the videos that i drop man all right do what you need to do get in tune with your boy all right let's get to it man but what we got on the agenda today man if y'all ain't got y'all raffle ticket for this guy, I don't know what the hell y'all is thinking about, man. First and foremost, man, you get two options of wheels. You can go with the drag packs, or I'm going to give y'all the option to take my 22, 24-inch setup wheels. Now, with these wheels, disclaimer, I got to just tell you, if you put them on without narrowing the rear end, it's going to put a big dent right here because it's going to hit the bottom of the uh fender and it's gonna put a big ass dent buckle right there so you definitely want to get the rear end narrowed if you put those wheels on all right got a brand new radio face plate in there for you so you ain't got to worry about that yes sir nice spicy 400 small block all forged internals definitely 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 a good car man new brand new fresh paint on it yep 
And uh, man, I'm excited about giving this thing away. I cannot wait to pick the winners. It's all done electronically, so you don't have to worry about any human error during the raffle. You are nice and safe, man. You're going to get you a great car. Not just a good car, a great car for only $20. So it could be you. you the only way you're going to win is if you take that risk. No one has ever won without taking a risk, all right? But you already know, man, we got all the trophies. That's right, man, ready, situated for the 4th of July car show. We got a bunch of fireworks that we're going to be popping off. The big boys, man, we spent a bag on some fireworks. So, yeah, definitely, definitely. Make sure y'all out there, man. Fourth of July is about to go down, man. It's early in the morning, man. Let me show y'all what time. Your boy's done to read, man. Get straight to it, man. Look, let me show y'all what time it is. I know y'all like, what the hell? Drag. 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 That's what we're going to be taking to Cincinnati, man. We're taking drag. So I actually got to go pick up Jack today. But look, it's 6, 11 in the morning, man. I'm outside making noise. About to, uh, you know what I'm saying? Get this, get to it, man. Shout out to my boy Lawsuit Jerry. I seen him yesterday. Lawsuit, I gotta just find a place to put your merch, man. I gotta find because that's a big ass hoodie. He gave me a book that big ass hoodie. I might have to put that thing on today. Uh, if it's a little, no, it is cool out here. It ain't that bad. But yeah, man, we're about to go ahead and uh, do what I've been telling y'all. I was about to do to the Reaper. That's right, man. I gotta go ahead and change out the 28s y'all know i just paid to get the rim in the back fixed but uh when the guy fixed it he missed two spots on the repair so it's leaking air so unfortunately well uh, hey i had to take them off now that i'm going out of town i'm not going to be going out of town on just two front 28s and the stock rims on the back so i'm gonna go ahead and just throw the factory rims back on the reaper for the 25th time and uh we gonna go ahead and uh get it just back situated roll ready for our trip to cincinnati tomorrow man i can't wait uh guys it's gonna be so many cars out there we they got cars coming from like pretty much a lot of different places man all over to come and rock out with your boy stunner reese CJ on 32s. Also, they just added Scarface to the event. That's right. That's right, man. Legendary Scarface. They just added him to the event. And also, they uh, got two short. We got Juvenile and 8 Ball and MJG, man. So, yeah, it's definitely going to be a lit ass show. That's right. Lit ass show, man. And uh, I can't wait to wait to come out there. Make sure y'all get there early, man. We're going to be there from like 10 o'clock in the morning to like 6 p.m. in that, you know what I'm saying, type of time frame. And uh, we're going to have a whole lot of fun, man. So y'all make sure y'all come out there and uh, show us some love, man. We traveling, you know, we're doing these shows and taking on these bookings. And we definitely want to see y'all, man. We don't just want to go out there uh, just... You know, just to go, we want to see y'all, all the stunt squizzy, all the 32 gang, man. Y'all, you know what I'm saying? Y'all the ones who believe in us and um, show us love. So, man, we want to come to y'all cities and show y'all love right back. So, that's what it is. So, I'm going to turn the Reaper around and face it in. Because um, as soon as I'm done with this, I got to go to the other house. And uh, we jumping in Kavari, and then we're going to come back to the other house, and we're going to uh, load up Drac. That's right. We're going to load up Drac and uh, bring that back over here and uh, get it cleaned up and pretty much ready for, you know, tomorrow is the game plan. So, yeah, that's what it is. All right, but yeah, like I said, y'all, July the 4th, man, don't play around, don't play no games, get there early. Guys, disclaimer, if you want to pay $25 to enter your car into the show, you need to, all right, you need to cash at me $25 to dollar sign one stunner Reese, all right, and uh, once you have cashed at me make sure you screenshot that cash app and then you're going to email it to me at videoreese at gmail.com 
along with a picture of your car and all of your contact information. All right, so that we can contact you if we got any questions. All right, so definitely that's all of those processes is mandatory if you want to get your car pre registered. If not, you're gonna have to just pay $40 when you get to the event. Um, and hey, it's gonna be what it's gonna be. It's gonna be what it's gonna be regardless, but you know what I'm saying? You just want to make sure if you want to save a little money, man, you know what I'm saying? Go ahead and uh, pre register. Oh, damn, I need to scoot this thing over. Yep, y'all forgot to screw it over. All right, man. Well, let me go ahead and get uh, the reaper situated so I can get these wheels changed. And I'll holler back at y'all in a minute, man. Early in the morning. All right, let's go. Squizzy Nicks. Wow. It's your boy, Stan Reese, man. I'm with me. It's Squizzy Nicks. Let's go. What in the hell is a Squizzy Mix? guys as you guys can see i got it all done actually i almost went viral this morning man i jacked up this wheel and i don't know if y'all caught it but the whole damn truck went backwards like four feet <laughs> so yeah but we got it done man now this thing definitely need a wash for the trip gotta get drag cleaned up and uh everything man everything gotta look decent for tomorrow uh so now that i got that done let me go ahead and park it back in this rightful spot. Then jump in the shower and everything, get ready. Cause I'm about to go see my dad, man, um, today. And I'll uh, show him him, him uh, Kavari. And um, cause my dad loves Corvettes, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I don't know if y'all heard in my other videos, my dad used to own many Corvettes. He had like five or six of them. And, uh, I just, I just, you know, part of the reason I really wanted the Corvette so bad is because my dad was a Corvette man, you know what I'm saying? So I uh, definitely want to go over there and share that experience with him of, uh, you know what I'm saying, seeing it. And uh, maybe we could take him for a ride. I don't know, but we're going to see. We're going to see, man. And uh, see what he think about the car. But yeah. Oh, I gotta take the and break off. But yeah, that's the plan. That's the goal. So, let's go ahead and try to achieve our today's goals. That's right, man. Going to see Pops. Going to see Pops. A uh, lot of my my hustle you know or my enthusiasm or however y'all want of my ambition to get up and get out and do things on my own and make things happen no matter what comes from my father um my dad ever since i was a kid always out grinding you know what i'm saying and making big moves not like just oh out here pet petty petty moves no like having a vision and making big moves and um man just always would never never forget some of the life lessons he he instilled in me you know what i'm saying as far as grinding now he'll grind anyway uh let me tell y'all a true story true story um my dad they had a and a new invention uh, back in the day 
when I was a kid. And it was uh, basically an invention that it was a stomach cruncher. It was basically almost look like a pogo stick, but it was a, a contraption that basically had two pedals, like bike pedals, that you stick your feet in with the straps over it. And then in between the pedals, it had a spring, okay, that was, came up, you know what I'm saying, lateral. And then at, attached to that spring was two, like, handlebars type of things. This almost looked like a pogo stick, but without the the stick at the bottom of the, you know, place where you stick your feet. And uh, it was a new ab cruncher that you basically put your feet in and you did like this, you know what I'm saying? Sway back and forth. It was supposed to get your abs um, like really, really tight. And you know, you how you looking like Arnold Schwarzenegger and all that. Um, nobody knew about it. It was uh, supposed to be the state of the art, you know what I'm saying? New stuff out at the time. And uh, my dad ordered a bunch of these things. Bunch of them. Bunch of them because he wanted to be like you know, ahead of the curve. So we used to go out and sell these things pretty much all over. You know what I'm saying? Anywhere we go, we sell them. You know what I'm saying? We would post up, sell them, post up, sell them. New ab cruncher. You know, and people back then, you know, they wasn't there wasn't a whole lot of gyms and stuff like it is now where where they advertising gyms on the radio and on TV all day long. No. It was you you know what I'm saying? Had to pretty much take initiative and uh, get yourself in, in order, go to the gym or, you know what I'm saying, or, um, you know, get out and exercise. But, you know, he just saw it as an opportunity to be one of the innovators in the game to bring it to Chicago, especially in our culture. Nobody really cared about, you know what I'm saying, working out like that. But my dad, he had a vision and we sold every single one of those things, every single one. And made a profit. And uh, he taught me, no matter what it is, the saying he used to tell me um, was, there's an ass for every seat. And that means basically anything, anything, somebody's going to have some type of attraction to it if you sell it to them the right way. So, hey, I learned that from my dad, and I've been using it in that theory, you know, ever since. So, guys, Man, it's going to be mean a lot to me to show this car to my dad. And I can't wait. So, y'all stick around, man, for the whole video, man. Don't skip ahead. Don't skip the ads. Like I told you, there's some drama happened too. Big drama. I'm going to tell y'all about that a little later on. But I'll holler at y'all in a minute. Let's get it. Let's go. Yeah. A few moments later. All right, gang. Your boy Stunner Reese is finally ready, man, to get up out of here, man. And, uh... Go take care of the business. We're about to jump in the Reaper and uh, go to the other property and um, basically jump in Kavari and go see my pops, man. So hopefully he's around. I got to call him. I still ain't called him yet, man. But I'm going to call him and uh, make sure he's around so we can get this done today. And uh, you know what I'm saying? Just have a good day, man. I, I, I really... Uh, hope that I get a chance to see my pops, man. That's something real important that I want to do. And, um, you know, just introduce y'all to my pops, man. You know, I know that's a uh, big hit with CJ. Um, but mine, uh, you know what I'm saying, is a little bit different reason. Like I said, it's really because of the fact that my dad is the one who really brought the Corvettes into my life. You know, I ain't gonna never front and say there's anything different other than that. I gotta replace this damn fuels in this damn cigarette light. But yeah, that's what it is. But I don't need no gas. At least that's good. Not right now. Not until we get ready to take off, man, for Cincinnati. Uh, man, I talked to my boy Mike B, the one who booked us from the show. He's super excited, man. He telling me it's so many people. Uh, registered and, and hitting them up telling them that they coming. We know we got the whole nap town coming. So it's about to be super lit. You know what I'm saying? It's about to be a super mega lit event. I already know. But uh, y'all just stick around, man. See what's going to happen today. I don't know everything 
but I do got some uh, some drama to tell y'all. Uh, y'all ain't gonna like this. Y'all is not gonna like this. But if y'all have it, man, make sure y'all go subscribe to Lady X. The, her uh, channel is in the description of this video and every video I drop. Uh, make sure y'all go show her some love and check out her video she dropped. Yeah, not good. All right, holla at y'all. All right, gang, so I finally got my paperwork done. You guys can see, man, we had to get all these damn show entry sheets printed out, man, but we got enough for the event. So, man, I'm uh, happy that I got that done. Uh, now I just have to uh, go over to the other property and, you know, go get Kavari and go, go try to see my dad, man. I, I hope he's available, but I just got a text, man, from the package company and yeah my damn gone Howling spoiler will be there tomorrow man i'm so damn excited about that man but uh actually right now before i go over there i gotta mail off some merch to one of my subscribers angela spencer appreciate you angela spencer for always showing love and support uh thank you so much so i'm about to send her her merch now she got one of the limited editions t-shirts with uh, the Doberman on it. It's got Scrappy on it. That's the last time you guys are ever going to see uh, a merch with Doberman and Scrappy on it, man. It's over with, y'all. It's over with, man. It's it been one. Um, we had merch when when I had the Yell Cat. Uh, we had merch when I had the Doberman. Uh, we got the merch you know, that I got now. It's the last limited run, man. Specialty shirts with uh, the Doberman, Scrappy, and Drac, all three vehicles on it. Uh, you will never see those again. So, uh, if you want one of those shirts, definitely make sure you hit me up in my DM on Instagram or send me an email at videoreese at gmail.com. We'll get it shipped out to you just like I'm about to ship her shirt out. All right, so do what you need to do, man. Get in tune, man. Get with the movie, man. Get that limited merch from your boy. Stella Reese, man. My email is in the description of all my videos, along with the link to buy them scrappy tickets, man. All right. Also, to buy them Esker wallets, if you want to grab one of them Esker wallets, man. Let me tell y'all about Esker wallets. So, if you're not up on the new wave of wallets, man, this is an Esker wallet, guys. It's got a quick release, easy button. You see how them cars just popped up, boop, and you just slide them right back down comes in many different colors leather material also other materials as well also it's got rfid protection on it so if somebody tries to scan your credit cards with one of those little machines they cannot do it it is blocked with the rfid protection on the uh actual wallet all right in addition to that it's got a tracking device that's right a tracking device so that uh if you lose your wallet by chance you can have the ability to track it with the app that's on your phone so it is super dope it's the new age of wallets so make sure you go in the description of my video and grab you an esker wallet with the quick pop-up button today yeah grab that today so you don't be left behind man step into the new age of wallets man get your ass wallet but i'm about to go in here and mail off her shirt so i'll holla at y'all in a minute let's get let's go yeah. all right gang your boy stunner reese man has finally made it over here to kavari that's right man and drac we're gonna be seeing drac a little later on we gotta come back because this car is going home with me tonight gotta get it cleaned up man and ready for the show tomorrow in cincinnati with the bloody goods drag 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 man y'all see this thing Ooh. Ooh. i don't know man y'all let me know man who going for the w now is it kavari or is it drag kavari or drag kavari or drag man who got the w who holding the title now man Ooh, this is a tough tough decision tough tough decision yes sir this thing looks so good though look at all this damn mud on my on my uh on my daggone uh tires man i'm i'm about to hate this that little spot right there what the hell no i definitely need to get this thing cleaned back up the bad thing is my driveway right here it's uh it holds water so whenever i go over in the 
uh, it uh, always, and I got this little mud spot right here. So yeah, it's not good, man. But we're about to jump in Kavari and uh, head over and see my pops, man. So y'all stick around, man. Don't skip ahead. And y'all already know, man, I still, still, still got the drama for y'all that y'all want to hear. I know y'all here for the drama. All right, let's go. Forget. Doberman wheels are still for sale. Seven inch lips fit any challenger or charger wide body. Get them right now, man. 5,500, man. Get those rims ASAP. All right, let's go. All right, guys, man. I have made it here to my dad. And he uh he saw the car. What you think about the car, Dad? I love the car. Yeah. The car is gorgeous. Yeah. It's gorgeous. What it remind you of? It's Ferrari. <laughs> I know, right? It's a Ferrari. Hey, that's the exact thing I told him. Now let me show you what the door handle yeah, I was is. Looking, I the, don't see what it yeah, they got is. it hidden under here. So uh -huh. you, you just press it under there. Oh, okay. And you can feel the rubber. Uh-huh. Yeah. yeah. That's gorgeous. Yeah. It's got the power seats and everything. It's got the target top. Just like your vets, man. Yeah. I told them yeah. my inspiration behind getting this is uh, my dad, when I was coming up, had many, many vets. Oh, yeah. Tell them about all the vets you had, I Dad. How many vets, vets, man? A lot, lot of, of them. He was a Corvette man. Yeah. All the way from the 70s all oh. the way to the 90s. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, he had many, many vets. Yeah. So, yeah, I always was like, man, I'm going to get me a vet one day. And I finally did this it. This is the ultimate American sports car. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Definitely up there. American sports car. Definitely. All right, let's All go right, for a ride, man. We're going to take my dad for a ride. They got a lot of new updated tricks and stuff with the new ones that the old ones didn't have. But uh, it's still real nice. Oh, this is gorgeous. Yeah, up there. That's what I was talking about. Oh, right there. Right there, yeah. Yeah, I, I see it now. Yeah, I, uh, so it, uh, you know what? Somebody stole my ladder from over at Pat's house. <laughs> I'm not surprised. Yeah, I don't, want you, I don't want you doing that anyway. No, I could have did no, that, though. I know, but I'm just saying, I don't want you doing that. The guys that you hire, don't they work for other people besides you? I got it. Yeah, but I, like I, just, I, I told I you, the situ come. I told you about the situation with the guy. Remember, I told you that he he a little, he be yeah yeah he be playing with the nose candy a little bit. So yeah. sometimes he he just answer. whenever he got time, I'll pay him. I no, just, you ain't gotta pay him. You, you can see it ain't that much. No, the, no, and no. The people who did this, they went out of business. Oh wow. They went out. They I had all 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 new. Yeah, but it's like a like you stuff. say, it's like a one inch gap. Yeah, yeah. I see it right there, yeah. just in that yeah. one spot. Yeah. Yeah. So, these cars are cool. They got the front end lift now, uh -huh. like the Ferraris and stuff, where uh -huh. it raises the front end. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying, and all that stuff. And I see your neighbor got one right here, across the street. Is that what it is? Yeah. I've seen it, but I didn't know. That's what is, uh, is the Corvette. Yeah, that's exactly what it is. They got a. Uh, they got the other red. He had a 2005 convertible, so he. Oh, did they? Yeah, so he traded it in and got the, the yeah. new one. I didn't know that was a new one. Yep. Okay. I see it. You heard it. Yeah. <laughs> we got one too. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'm impressed. <laughs> I'm impressed. That's what's up. Boy, I tell you, man, black women, man. Hey, can't let you have that. She screamed, y'all. I got one too. You know what I'm saying? That's crazy. You can't just say congratulations, young black man. Right. You're doing something. Right. Positive. But no, she screamed, I got one too. Right. Boy, I tell you, man, women. When? I'm surprised she even said anything. Yeah, you are, she screamed it. I, we didn't even say nothing didn't to her. Say nothing. She just had to scream it out. Nothing. Yeah. But this car, you know, it's got the mirror that uh, is a camera out oh. the back of the car. So oh, okay. this is not actual the, the mirror. This is a camera shooting out the back. Oh wow. Uh, and it's got night vision and everything. Oh, of course, it's got all the heads up display oh. and stuff like that. Everything is touchscreen. Uh, you don't even have to use none of these controls right here. You could do everything through the touchscreen. Oh wow! It's got the 
Apple Connect and all that stuff, the CarPlay, uh -huh. navigation, all the Wi-Fi hotspot. You can use the car as a Wi-Fi hotspot. Mm -hmm. So um, it's got the paddle shifters like a Ferrari. Oh, wow. Yeah. yeah it's it's nice. Real well thought out. You and it's deserve this, uh, son. Yeah. You thank this. you. Thank you. Yes. Thank you. And it's solid. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's not, you know how the older Corvettes, mm -hmm. you know, they had a little bit of like squeaking and, you know, rattling and stuff. But... Right. Uh, this one, this was, it's pretty nice. When I test drove it, I was like, man, it's, it's a solid, tight car. It's gorgeous. It's gorgeous. It's got the 10 speed transmission. I like this color. Yeah, I like oh, this color. It's oh, vibrant, right? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Looks way better than the red that they got across the street. <laughs> I seen that. They got that car yesterday. I seen that car, but I didn't know that was a Corvette. Yeah, yeah. I thought cool. that was uh, something else. Oh, I didn't like know that was a Corvette. Yeah, yeah, it's a Corvette. They just got it yesterday? Yeah, they just got that yesterday. Oh, wow. Yeah. Well, when I come back, I'm going to definitely tell them congratulations. Yeah. Congratulations. So have Crystal seen the car yet? She saw it on internet, uh, oh, okay. and uh, she hasn't came to the house. Uh -huh. My mom seen it, of course. Uh -huh. uh, so yeah, she likes it too. Uh, What's not the like? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> what's not the like? So I, you know, you know what's crazy, Dad? That what? some people in my comment section were saying that this is a downgrade oh. from my challenge. Oh, yeah. <laughs> right. Oh, what, yeah. what is? I like. Where do y'all get that? Who's who? Who says that this is a downgrade That's from folks a... that don't know no better. <laughs> That's folks that don't know no better. I, I don't know what the hell somebody would think That's, that a challenger that is even on the same better. level right. as this car. Even at this this level. Even at this level. Uh -huh. And it's uh it's quick too. I ain't gonna lie. I, it's, I know. It's real quick. I, I believe go ahead. No, I ain't finna go fast. Yeah. So I, I had to put the uh the front end lift up to go over these bumps right here. Yeah. And uh, I mean, it's cool. It got the engine in the back, mm -hmm. just like the Ferrari and all that stuff. Mm -hmm. It's a cool car. Front here, back down. Quiet. Even with the top off, it's not like real and, and, overly. And you'll be surprised; these cars don't burn a lot of gas. No, it doesn't. They don't burn a lot it's of su gas. It's surprisingly fuel efficient, right? Yeah. Yeah. No, don't it, burn a lot of gas. it don't. Yeah, it don't burn a lot of gas. It's such a aerodynamic car, mm -hmm. and the way they got the transmission and the tune on it. Mm -hmm. uh, now, I, I can hit this little button right here. It's, it's called a Z mode. Uh -huh. uh, then it wakes up. The car gets louder and everything. It, oh, okay. it puts it in a, a more aggressive like tune uh -huh. and everything. Uh -huh. Did you hear that? Yeah, I can hear. Yeah, it. yeah, the, yeah. Now it's in Z mode, so now it's uh, it, you know it shifts a little harder mm -hmm. and all that stuff. Uh, and then you just hit the button and it quiet it back down. These are good road cars. Oh, absolutely. Good road cars. So. My best friend CJ on 32s, uh -huh. he just got rid of his Hur uh, his Lamborghini Huracan, uh -huh. and I rode in that car for the first time uh -huh. uh, like a week ago. Right. And uh, I mean, you are literally sitting up like this, Dad. Oh, oh it's it's very uncomfortable. Mm -hmm. oh. It not be nothing I would want to like <laughs> like take for a cross country trip. Right. But this right. car, real comfortable. It's comfortable. got the lumbar comfortable. seats. Comfortable. It's got all the creature comforts, adjustable seats, and everything. That's a nice car. And the way they tune the suspension and everything, it's like you don't really feel the bumps or anything. Mm -hmm. Now, he just bought a, a, a Vince door, mm -hmm. yellow. Mm -hmm. The Lamborghini with the doors go up. Oh, my God. That is got to be one of the most beautiful cars I've ever seen in my life. Mm -hmm. But um, we was talking, you know what I'm saying, the other day. He was, like, saying that a lot of people say that it's kind of got, like, a bouncy ride all the time. Uh-huh. And uh, I was driving behind him, and you could kind of see it bouncing a little bit. Mm -hmm. But with that car, I would have to deal with the bouncing because the car is so beautiful, man. It's just like, hey, I'm going to just deal with the bouncing because the car is absolutely gorgeous. It's got a pretty much all race suspension, Olin suspension and everything on it. So it's a, it's a nice car. Nice car. 
Uh, you make sure you uh, check your surroundings when you pull up someplace because people are carjacking cars, man. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Well, you, you know, know I got my good care, I know. You know I got my concealed and carry, yeah. right? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, but if they take it, they can have it. I got. I know. I got. Gap, I know. I got you gap. Got to be careful. Yeah, I got gap insurance. So yeah. yeah, they take this thing, you can have it. Yeah, I, my gap insurance is gonna pay get it off. Another, right? Yeah, and get me another. That's yeah. right. So yeah, nah, I gotta go home to my daughter and uh, my family, man. At I'm, the end of the day, I know that's right. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm glad you came by and showed me the car. This is so nice. Thank you. But and I'm glad. I just thought about you. You've seen what I was talking about. I, I want that done, done as soon as this so, guy can come, and I, I'll give him some. for come over there to screw those screws. Yeah. On that yeah. thing, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, crazy! Somebody stole my ladder. I could have came and did that in in ten minutes. I mean, but, with uh, this pandemic, I, a lot of companies went out of business and they they went back in business with. Uh, no work. Nobody was doing anything. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's crazy. Yeah. This uh, pandemic definitely slowed a lot of stuff down. Oh, it put a lot of people out of business. Oh, absolutely. A lot of people out of business. Absolutely. Hunter, she works for a, a company, and, and they had her working at home. And, uh, and now they permanently keep it up. Oh, so she, she, she works from home now. From now. She yeah. don't even have to go yep. in anymore. She ain't got to do nothing. That's what's up. Yeah. That's what's up. Yeah. But, yeah, I, I'm proud of you. That's thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Now, the, the get out the car, you just press this button right here. It's a little button right here. Can you see it right there? Oh, yep. okay. Yep. Uh, done yourself son. oh thank you all right guys we'll be back let's go all right guys real quick man about to show you guys my dad's bmw he currently has but this is my dad's tow truck man guy enterprises this is a uh, man i'm a company that my dad made me vice president of and one day we're gonna get this truck back on the road you know what i'm saying there go my dad's boat right there he got the bay liner what size is that a 20 24 footer, 24 footer. Uh -huh. and let me show you my dad's bmw that's right man it's the james bond yeah james bond this now this is your second one or third one of these the, uh, second, one. second one of these yeah, yeah. my dad loves bmw y'all remember i had the big shine on it no uh, dust no oh yeah oh yeah, yeah. this car this been under like the new. yeah it's yeah. definitely like new my dad keep it under the car cover. And y'all remember, well, some of y'all really remember when I had the BMW 850. Uh, that's the reason I got that car because my dad loved BMWs too. <laughs> yeah, my dad is a BMW man and he's been a Corvette man all my life. Those are two brands he loved. He always had to get the uh, the one with the sport wheels. This is the second one you had with the sport wheels. Yep. Yeah, that's yep. the way to go. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. These are nice cars. Nice cars. You don't get to you don't drive it that much no more, do you? No, because I told you yeah. about my surgery. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My dad had a couple of surgeries, so he don't really drive it too much uh, anymore. But he got them though. He got it. Yeah. Definitely. But well, Dad, I appreciate you. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Showing everybody the car. We got the boat. That's right, man. And we, like I said, we gonna me and my brother, man. We got a someday. Get this truck back on the back on the road, man. Like back in the back in the day, it's one of the businesses. Like I said, my dad always had a hustler mentality. He was gonna make it work regardless or whatever. So yep, definitely, definitely. But we're about to go over to Extreme Custom Wheels, guys, and uh, look at some wheels they got over there in stock. Um, I know I told y'all I want to get some wheels. They got a pair in stock. They want me to come and see. So y'all, you know what I'm saying? We're gonna see what we see on the C8, on Kavari and see if we like them or not. But uh, I'll holler at y'all in a minute, man. Let's get it, let's go. All right, gang, we have made it here, man. I know I got copyright in the back, so I'm gonna go ahead and just show y'all the uh, wheels and uh, I'll talk to y'all when I get outside, let's go.
right, guys. I was just seeing the wheels they got in stock. Uh, drop in the comments and let me know what y'all think about those wheels. All right? Let me know what y'all think about those wheels. But All right. Nice little bins right here. Sitting on the bees. Looking good. Nice and saucy. But, man, this is my sis' new truck. Guys, we're going to come back one day once my phone is charged up. And we're going to actually do a full review on this thing. I promise you guys, this thing is crazy. She just showed me some of the features and stuff. I was trying to let my phone charge up. But, guys, I got so much stuff to get ready for this trip tonight that I ain't going to be able to sit and uh, wait for my phone to charge up because I ain't got my regular charger. But it's sitting on 4 Gs. Those are specialty 4 Gs. We're going to tell y'all all about that and everything, guys. I promise y'all, this is going to be a dope-ass review. All right? So that's going to be coming soon, man. But... Kavari, I don't know, guys. We're going to listen uh, to the Stunt Squizzy 32 gang and see what they say about those wheels. But, guys, this thing just popped out, man. I had to show y'all this, man. It's nasty. Ooh, yes, sir. Good. Oh. Good. Oh. Yeah, he did that. Did that. Definitely make sure y'all come to Extreme Custom Wheels, man. They offer uh, a lot of different 4Gs in stock for a lot of different cars. Uh, man, they got some nice wheels in here, and I love these. Y'all know I like that black-on-black -black look. This thing go crazy, 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 man. Crazy. Uh, all right. My boy Steve just showed me another set of wheels. Steve, can you send me that picture? I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna send it to CJ and I'm gonna ask him what he think. And uh, how long would it take him to ship them here? About less, less than a week, four or five days. Okay, all right. So yeah, we got a we got an option that uh, we gonna we gonna see what CJ say and then go from there. All right, so y'all just stick around, man. Let's get let's go. All right, gang, so my battery is about to die, so I'm gonna go ahead and tell y'all the drama, man. This is what y'all been waiting on, man. All right, let me cut this music down, man. All right, guys, so... Your boy Stunner Reese was in South Carolina over the weekend. And... Well, no, actually Monday and Tuesday. Today is Friday. While I'm in South Carolina... I get a call from Lady X calling me real upset. And I'm wondering, what in the world is going on here? You know what I'm saying? Why is she so upset? She calls me and says, you had some clothes that you put in the washing machine and uh, in the dryer, I'm sorry. And I found a rubber in your clothes in the dryer not in my clothes actually it had fell out of my clothes into the dryer when she was taking my clothes out nevertheless y'all already know how it went from there so she found a, a condom in my clothes it, well not in my clothes i keep saying in my clothes in the dryer and man it was so hard to calm her down of course she was irate I gotta hurry up and get through this this part because my phone is about to die and my charge is in the, the reaper. But guys, listen. All I can say is it was not a condom that I recently had. The condom was uh, dated with an expiration date of 2022. It was balled up, wrinkled. You could tell it was super old, old condom. And uh uh, condoms, for y'all don't know, rubbers from it's normally a, a shelf life, and they date it for a reason uh, of uh, five years. You know, what I'm saying around five years. Well, this condom was to expire in 2022. I just actually met Lady X last year, okay, in uh, 2020. So. Uh, after I explained to her, you know what I'm saying, and she did some research and stuff, she, we found out that, you know what I'm saying, that the, the condom was a condom that I had from a long time ago. It was in one of my pair of pants that I had when I had the Yellow Cat Hellcat, y'all. 
So y'all know, uh, you know, that's a long time. So the condom was in my pants and uh, when it got washed and dried, uh, it had been in there a long time. It, um, you know, fell out. So, you know, she was, she was cool. She was understanding after that, but yeah, it was not a good situation, man. Yeah, so Lady X, whoo, but luckily the good thing is, like I said, the condom had a date on it. So she was able to research it and find out that it was a very old condom. Uh, by everything that the dates and everything so yeah that's what it is man but but yeah guys that's gonna wrap this video up man i'll let y'all know uh about the wheels um all y'all all i can say is stay tuned man y'all y'all uh y'all find out you know what i'm saying and uh we'll go from there but i'll holler at y'all next video it's your boy still be checking out man peace today's video is brought to us by the street whip stunting facebook group if you're into custom cars, the Big Wheel culture, Big Wheel racing, or anything customized with cars, motorcycles, and trucks, make sure you join the Facebook group, Street Whip Stunting. You can post all your pictures, all your videos, and it's free. So definitely click the link in the description of this video and join the Facebook group, Street Whip Stunting. Hey, hey, hey. Can, uh, subscribe, share. Oh, uh, what does it like for you to get? Subscribe, square, like. Square? Oh, yeah. Shit. <laughs> All right, subscribe, square. Yeah, subscribe, share, and like. So it ain't square. It's square. And share. All right, that's Subscribe to my man.